Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Akira and welcome to this reaction video of the newest uh, Nintendo Direct that was showing as of this recording yesterday. Uh, I was not home to um, do the recording on reaction or live streaming it or anything, so <laughs> that is uh, the ban of the, or the curse actually, of them showing the directs apparently the days where I'm not home. So I will take it today and um, I hope you will enjoy my reactions and um, I'm looking forward to seeing what they're showing. Um, for hopes in this direct, I actually don't have that many because there will show things that will come out the rest of this year, maybe something new for next year. Uh, and we also do know that there will not be a DLC for the Zelda games, so I'm not hoping to see anything for that. So I actually don't know. Maybe they will show something for the new Splatoon. Uh, and I had heard rumors about um, another code getting a remake, which I'm pretty sure my editor will uh, really be looking forward to. So. If it's true, she actually will know already if there's a remake of it because I think she already have seen it. So I'll jump into it and let's just enjoy it. It's in the direct. Well, we start off with Spatoon apparently. It's still kind of creepy that it's so white. So I'm really looking forward to why that is. This looks way too clean. Okay, that's creepy again. What's that pearl? My pearl's a robot. Okay, that's actually a pretty nice outfit she has on. But I'm guessing this is just like the auto expansion maybe where you have to do missions uh, to advance the story. Maybe? That would make the most sense since they made the whole story mode that way also in Spectrum 3. Because that just works. So, do we also get a release date? Hello, everyone. Oh, okay. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll Konnichiwa. be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. So, it's more like a roguelike, maybe? Where you get stronger and stronger every time you play? Oh, that would actually be pretty fun. Donkey Kong has stolen all the I never played Mario it, though, but... <laughs> it actually looked kind of fun. It's but is this remake or... Reach it with a handstand jump or a backflip, like that. Oh yeah, because you're jumping higher when you're using your hands. <laughs> but yeah, it's not really my type of game, so. Save the prince. Dash through breathtaking environments. I actually remember having uh, Prince of Persia Persia for my. But don't linger too long. Um, to survive. Amiga uh, uh, 600 <laughs> back in the days. As well as time powers to best these hostile lands. Uh, things have changed a little since then. Let's just say that. Grow stronger and learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Defeat the mythical beast. Hello, the little fella. In your way. <laughs> a Ubisoft original. <laughs> Is that a thing now? These games will help you chase your passions while yeah. overtaking your rivals on the road. For some reason, card games have not really been my thing, other than Mario Kart. And more. Um, you can also and I will say burnout, and um, but I do like the needs. crash mechanic in that Pitching game. Other than that, mm. up to four friends can battle it out in versus modes, or jam together in local or online play. Super crazy rhythm castle. What is there some music games, by the way? I remember the uh, the pitching game today, from the last direct. On weekdays, you'll head to class. That then can't be a good thing. I have evening. not seen the show, but <laughs> what I know of the show. Visit all sorts of exciting places. Okay, I will keep Mario's an eye out for that game. RPG adventure returns. The Super yeah, I'll be all for that, funnily back, enough. <laughs> with updated graphics. Let's go over some new and returning game. Are you sure those are updated? <laughs> So good. Action command I never played the original one, by the way, so I'm full, really looking forward to this one. The three move. But these I'm actually, actually glad that they stayed true to the the original one. 
like, as I said, I had... I have not played it, but I've seen this place of it, so... Set off for adventure with Mario and friends. When Super I do really Mario like that they RPG just keep so much of it. On the Nintendo Switch like that. November 17th. Pre-orders are available now <sighs> on Nintendo Wii Shop. I have so many games around there. <laughs> uh, Wonders also comes, like, a month before? We're alive. We're almost there. <sighs> oh yeah, that X, actually. Uh, not a code. The Nintendo DS game nice. Trace Memory returns on the Nintendo Switch system as another code to memories. Seeking answers, she sets off for the I actually have a list play of that done by the editor of this video again. on my channel. If people are interested Once in there, seeing the DS version of the game. Puzzles and obstacles. So this yeah, that's right. The second game hug. didn't come out here. Play both games to experience uh, the full story. I did it. Unravel both I don't know if it's just North America, but I can't Nintendo remember Switch if you actually got it too. Code, not. Well, I don't have graphics. Please look forward to playing them. Well, that is a game year. I'm gonna get. Next, please take a look at this. I'm curious to some of the puzzles actually because I knew they were like you have to close the DS and stuff like that. So I'm thinking about how they will fix that. Oh, that's the piece game that we're showing, was it? Wicked grape and the sour bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took the <laughs> sour bunch. <stage. laughs> Fair enough. Now it's up to Peach and the theater's guardian Stella to save the play. It's still weird to see Peach day. without her crown on. <laughs> Actually, looks interesting. I hope that we get more info on it um, down the road, depending on when, of course, when it releases. Princess it seems like um, a game. <laughs> Pre -orders begin today okay, that's some time for this. So I guess we're gonna get more information about it uh, before it comes out. That was a new look so I'm interested. Showtime. The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing onto Nintendo Switch in one daring collection. As the fearless but why upgrading it? The graphics that then was perfect. The world and swan dive through perilous quests spanning different countries <laughs> and mythologies. Swan dive, you mean the, the way Along I killed the myself way, the most of the times <laughs> I played the game because I broke my neck? The ancient world. Every great detective starts their day early. A two day. While searching for Harry, Tim's missing father. Is he missing again? I have people. not played the first game. <laughs> to be fair. Pokemon. Oh god, oh no. <laughs> Raise your brass. Why? Rhythm game, trombone champ. Play the notes in time. Not that I have anything against the game, but will <laughs> come on. But how you play that it's horn is up such to a you. weak game. You can use gyro controls to adjust the pitch up and down. Or the IR motion camera on the right Joy-Con controller. Wow, they're actually using the that for something? Isn't there like only five or six games that use the motion control, control thing uh, for the, the infrared thing? Everything in between. <laughs> Plus, up to four oh god. Can band together in local multiplayer. Trombone champ slides onto Nintendo Switch. <laughs> I feel sorry for today. everyone <laughs> that had to go through that torture. That Again, is a, an amazing game, by the way. Nintendo Switch games. Before battle, equip your mercenaries with the best gear and skills to claim Why does this interface looks has uh, like um, up to four players online? Uh, I'm thinking of the other called the upload. Journey together. Uh, I just need the mana bar world. and uh, the health bar. <laughs> launches as a timed crush. The red falcon. Uh, I remember when I was younger, I played. Um, I'm pretty sure it was Contra. Uh, I played in the. Our burger this joint had uh, cons uh, uh, arcade cabinets, and I'm pretty sure one of them was Contra. Uh, the other one was Killing Instinct. <laughs> so I played it a bunch when I was younger. Early next year. I think now though is not that kind of game that I want to play, to be fair. Your Why does this look like a... Unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Legend speaks of your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. Oh, I actually thought it would be an attack to what it looks like. The path before us is laid bare, and all that remains now uh, is just like um, a fire emblem. Walk it, I will, mother. I do like the art style, though. Freely traverse and expand. For some reason, I'm a little sucker for art styles like uh, drawn things. Uh, that looks more drawn than 3D animated. Oh, so this is a tactical. 
Available March 8th, 2024. That is an interesting name. <laughs> I will say the, the only Luigi's Mansion, Luigi's <laughs> Luigi Mansion I've played trap. is um, Luigi's Mansion 3. Uh, but I do really want to play the first two games. So that is actually a good uh, reason to get this one, I guess. Uh, now, uh, the question is though if they will uh, release the first one too at some point. How do they have the whole the GameCube? Release all GameCube games thing going to on. <laughs> also coming for the online. The no, isn't it already on the online? Returns as a 99 player battle royale. Oh fucking hell! Nope. That sounds like a bad time. <laughs> And we just know that some people are gonna get crazy with this game because they're good at, uh, at um, minimaxing. Oh yeah, if you can get one. I actually don't know how easy those are to get. I just know that I'm trying for the longest time now to get a uh, N64 controller and it's just impossible. So is this our farming simulator? <laughs> it's starting to sound like a farming simulator. Oh yeah, I thought so. uh, the one character I was about to say in the beginning that one of the characters looked like a lead to this character. So that explains now. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. I don't even think I'm done with this last uh, mile, uh, mile, uh, the last mile where they made. This is your home base. Why do I actually think that every time they show off uh, um, an RPG game or something like that, it's always the same dialogue story we get uh, from the narrators? <laughs> Justice. <laughs> Apparently, Magic Ghost is a part of this game. A heroic tale will begin as they adjust a country life in a mountain. So, and not a family simulator. This but I do like how bouncy they were, uh, the characters. Get back but I think I have group. enough family simulators. <laughs> oh, Dave the Diver. I so much want that game. Then serve them as sushi by it night. looks so much fun. Adventure, Dave the Diver. I do like that it's kind of like a roguelike uh, restaurant simulator game. <laughs> Dave the Diver. So, but yeah, it looks so much fun. I've the seen uh, Gap Smokers play it a lot. So, Here's a sneak peek at wave six, Ooh, what do we get? Wave of the Mario Kart Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. From the Mario Kart Wii game, I am thinking of making a series where I play through all, uh, where I play through all the stages at some point, where I take one cover at a time, uh, at some point. Oh, you're welcome. Recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can look forward to playing from September onwards. Let's take a look. Haven't you already done that with the the Luigi's Mansion and the Peach game? Oh, that's. Oh right, the Pikmin games, I forgot about them. But yeah, okay, it's more like a recap of what game's coming out in, in total. Oh, I can't talk today. That is uh Paper Mario probably a door? Isn't it? It is a Paper Mario. I think just the book reminds me of Half the Door. Not that I'm complaining, I'm really enjoying the Paper Mario games. So I could actually be interested in it, because it's one of the Paper Mario games I don't have. <laughs> uh, and I have a ton of fun with Origami King. Um I do know that I never finished the uh, Let's Play off it. Um, there was just too much reading, I think, for it to be fun for me to stream it, because I'm not the best reader. I don't know if I'm mistaken, the Thousand Year Door is one of the, um, one of the most liked uh, Paper Mario game. If I'm not mistaken, it's sometime next year. Paper Mario, the I am intrigued. Door, originally released on Nintendo GameCube. Thank you for watching. 
So, just a quick recap. Fountain Your Door, I'm interested in because it's a Paper Mario game that I haven't played yet. Uh, another code, it's interesting that they get both the games. As again, I played the first one, and they also, as I said, is a let's play of uh, my editor that's editing this video right now. Uh, playing the first one on my channel. Uh, you can go and find it. I will, If I remember, I will link it in the description. Then, of course, we had the Splatoon I'm looking forward to. And the same with um, the Mario uh, DLC. Mario Kart DLC. <laughs> um, some of the Amiibos I'm interested in, but I don't know if I have the money for them. It's the, even though they're really pretty, they're still expensive. So, there's that. Um, but I'm really looking forward to a lot of that that showed off. But most of it I already have pre-ordered in some way, shape or form, like Super Mario Wonders, even though they didn't show that much of it here. And now the Peach game and Luigi's Mansion. Uh, there weren't really that many third-party games other than another code I think I would be interested in. Uh, but we have to see. Again, there's a lot of things that I don't have that much touch in. So, but uh, I hope you like my reaction, even though I'm not the biggest reactor. Um, <laughs> to things I I still I, I think it's fun, more fun to react to things together with other people but um, it's not always possible so yeah but um, I hope you enjoyed this little look into what's coming up and please tell me in the comment if you want me to react to anything other than just Nintendo reacts because that's the most things I'm keeping track of other times it's only just trailers for single things and I don't really react to them but tell me if you want me to and other than that Thank you all so much for stopping by, and I hope to see you all next time. So until then, take care everyone, and goodbye.